Hey guys, I want to make a quick video about a problem that's been bothering me um, all winter that I just solved. Um, so for those of you who don't know what this is, this is the glow plug, not the glow plug, the, the block heater um, plug kit um, for my uh, 7.3 F350. Um, about six weeks ago, naturally in the middle of winter, um, this thing just stopped working. Um, it basically tripped the GFI plug in my garage and it wouldn't go back. So after basically working the problem, uh, looking at the extension cords I was using, looking at um, replacing the GFI plug, replacing the breaker, um, you know, buying heavier gauge extension cords, absolutely nothing was working. Uh, I took this thing off, um, hooked my voltmeter up to it. It was reading, um, you know, 15 ohms, which is perfect. Um, for those of you who don't know, I think the upper end is 25, the lower end is five. Head continuity. Um, so everything electrically seemed to be working fine, but as soon as I would uh, plug this in, uh, the GFI, um, you know, would pop in my garage. So um, last night, for giggles, uh, I just took it out, looked at it, um, got a pair of needle nose pliers like this, basically got in here and just crushed down the electrical connections to make sure they had a, a more... Uh, firmer fit more snug fit and I just tried it and everything worked great uh, the GFI didn't trip um, it was it was it was doing its job it was as supposed to so I've seen plenty of videos on YouTube about how to replace your glow plug you know what to or not your glow plug your, your core heater um, you know what to check if it's if it's bad um, but I've never saw one that explained how if those uh, copper connections in here and these two aren't aren't snug to your 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 core heater element that it could trip your gfi uh i've had this uh core heater cord for uh two years and just you know in the middle of january it started giving me a trouble so just wanted to like I said pass this along to where if you all of a sudden um you know can't it's tripping your gfi or breaker in your house just make sure to take a smear of small needle nose pliers just get in here and crush it uh, before you basically tear out the electrical in your house, replace GFI plugs like I did, unfortunately. Um, and hopefully you can see if that solves your problem. Um, you know, five minutes doing this when nothing else seems to work and you've already used your voltmeter, everything seems to be working out great. It can save you a lot of frustration, time, and, and energy otherwise. So anyway, hope this video helped someone out with uh, the core heater issue. And uh, on this Ford made core heaters like this for almost a lot of their vehicle lines, so more than likely this could apply to you. So anyway, guys, have a good one.